Envision a realm untouched by time. A sanctuary where nature holds dominion. Welcome to Heard Island and McDonald Islands. Nestled in the vastness of the Southern Ocean, these islands showcase the raw, untamed essence of our planet. They remain largely unknown to the world, and even fewer have ever set foot on their shores. These islands serve as a living laboratory of evolution, where life has adapted to some of the harshest conditions on Earth. Embark with us on a journey to the edge of the world. Unveil the mysteries of Heard and MacDonald Islands. Heard and MacDonald Islands are home to some of the most remote and active volcanoes on Earth. The islands are often battered by fierce storms, adding to their wild and untamed beauty. Big Ben, the highest peak on Heard Island, frequently erupts, sending plumes of ash and steam into the sky. These volcanic activities shape the rugged landscape and create a dramatic backdrop against the stormy seas. Despite the harsh conditions, these islands are a haven for unique wildlife, thriving in the shadow of the volcanoes. Heard and McDonald Islands are far from your typical island paradise. Forget about palm trees and white sandy beaches. These islands are born from fire, emerging from the Earth's molten core. They rise from a volcanic plateau, a testament to the planet's dynamic forces. Over millions of years, volcanic activity pushed lava upward, breaking through the ocean's surface. This is how Heard and McDonald Islands came into existence. Sharp volcanic peaks pierce the sky, their slopes marked by ancient lava flows. These flows, now solidified into black basalt, stand as silent witnesses to the island's fiery birth. The islands are part of the Kerguelen Plateau, one of the largest volcanic regions on Earth. Heard and McDonald Islands are just the visible peaks of this volcanic province, offering a glimpse into the Earth's fiery depths. Heard and McDonald Islands are a testament to the raw power of nature, sculpted by both ice and fire. These remote islands showcase a dramatic interplay between glacial ice and volcanic activity, creating a unique and breathtaking environment. The ever-changing landscape is a living record of the Earth's dynamic processes, offering a glimpse into the forces that shape our planet. Heard and McDonald Islands are situated in the path of the relentless Roaring Forties and the Furious Fifties. These powerful winds, unobstructed by any significant landmass, sweep across the islands with tremendous force. They bring with them fierce storms, heavy rain and snow, creating a harsh environment for both inhabitants and researchers. The island's position in the Southern Ocean ensures they are enveloped by frigid, nutrient-dense waters. These waters support a rich variety of marine species. The average temperature on Heard Island remains near freezing, seldom rising above 5 degrees Celsius, even during summer. This erratic and often harsh climate has molded the island's flora and fauna, compelling life to adapt to the severe conditions. Envision a realm where vegetation clings to volcanic rock, a realm where mosses and lichens paint the scenery in hues of green and grey. These islands, though severe and unforgiving, host a surprising variety of plant species. These plants are resilient. They have evolved to endure the island's extreme climate and volcanic soils. Mosses and lichens are the predominant plants on the islands. They form a dense carpet over the rocky terrain, adding a splash of colour to an otherwise stark landscape. In more protected areas, where a thin layer of soil has accumulated, grasses and flowering plants can be found. One such plant is the Kerguelen cabbage, a large edible plant found on both Heard and McDonald Islands. This plant, with its broad leaves and bright yellow flowers, is a crucial source of nourishment for the island's wildlife. Heard and McDonald Islands are a sanctuary for diverse penguin species. These remote islands host four breeding species, king penguins, macaroni penguins, gentoo penguins, 
and eastern rockhopper penguins. These remarkable birds flourish in the island's frigid, nutrient-dense waters. Annually, they return to the islands to breed and nurture their offspring. King penguins, the largest of the penguin species, are frequently seen on the islands. They congregate in enormous colonies, sometimes reaching tens of thousands. Macaroni penguins, with their striking yellow crests, bring vibrant hues to the penguin gatherings. Gen 2 penguins, the swiftest of all penguin species, The waters around Heard and McDonald Islands are alive with seals. These marine mammals play a crucial role in the island's ecosystem. Four seal species are prevalent here. Southern elephant seals, Antarctic fur seals, leopard seals, and crab-eater seals. Southern elephant seals are the titans of the seal world. Males can reach lengths of up to six meters and weigh more than 4,000 kilograms. During the breeding season, they come ashore and engage in intense battles for dominance. Once hunted to near extinction, Antarctic fur seals are now rebounding. Leopard seals, with their sleek, spotted coats and reptilian look, are the top predators of the Southern Ocean. Despite their name, crab-eater seals primarily consume The flora and fauna of Heard and McDonald Islands exist in a delicate balance. The island's isolation and extreme climate have created a unique ecosystem. This ecosystem is home to a surprising diversity of life, but it is also vulnerable to change. Climate change, invasive species and human activity all pose threats to this fragile environment. The island's glaciers are melting at an alarming rate. This melting is causing sea levels to rise. It is also altering the salinity of the surrounding waters. These changes could have a profound impact on the island's marine life. Invasive species, such as rats and mice, have already been introduced to some of the islands. Protecting this pristine environment is crucial. Heard and McDonald Islands are a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The flora and fauna of Heard and McDonald Islands exist in a delicate balance. The island's isolation and extreme climate have created a unique ecosystem. This ecosystem is home to a surprising diversity of life, but it is also vulnerable to change. Climate change, invasive species and human activity all pose threats to this fragile environment. The island's glaciers are melting at an alarming rate. This melting is causing sea levels to rise. It is also altering the salinity of the surrounding waters. These changes could have a profound impact on the island's marine life. Invasive species, such as rats and mice, have already been introduced to some of the islands. Protecting this pristine environment is crucial. Heard and McDonald Islands are a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Heard and McDonald Islands are more than just stunning vistas. They serve as natural archives, providing scientists with priceless data about Earth's ancient history. Their remoteness and distinctive geological features make them perfect for research in various scientific fields, including paleoclimatology and plate tectonics. By studying volcanic rock layers, Researchers can reconstruct the island's volcanic activity history. These eruptions, occurring over millions of years, have created a comprehensive record of Earth's geological processes. The glaciers on these islands also contain vital historical clues. Ancient air bubbles trapped in the ice offer snapshots of Earth's atmosphere from thousands of years ago. By examining these air bubbles, scientists can monitor changes in greenhouse gas levels over time, offering crucial Heard and McDonald Islands are experiencing the direct effects of climate change. Situated in the rapidly warming Southern Ocean, these islands provide a clear view of our planet's changing climate. 
Researchers are leveraging these islands as a natural observatory to understand climate change impacts on glaciers, wildlife, and marine ecosystems. The glaciers on these islands are retreating at a concerning pace. With global temperatures climbing, these glaciers are melting more rapidly than they can regenerate. The increasing water temperatures around the islands are significantly affecting marine ecosystems. Variations in water temperature and salinity are altering the distribution and population Heard Island is one of the rare places on Earth where active volcanism and glacial ice coexist. This unique combination creates a geological marvel, offering scientists a rare chance to study the interaction between these two powerful forces. Mawson Peak, the island's active volcano, stands as a constant reminder of the fiery power beneath the surface. Researchers employ a variety of techniques to monitor Mawson Peak's activity. Seismometers record tremors and earthquakes, providing insights into the movement of magma below. Gas sensors track changes in volcanic gas emissions, indicating shifts in volcanic activity. The interaction between the volcano and the surrounding glaciers creates a dynamic and ever-evolving landscape. Volcanic eruptions can melt significant amounts of ice, leading to floods and altering the flow of glaciers. Despite their remote location and extreme environment, Heard and McDonald Islands boast a remarkable array of life. These islands serve as a natural laboratory for scientists to observe evolutionary processes in real time. The isolation of these islands has led to a high level of endemism, with many species that exist nowhere else on the planet. Penguins on these islands are a major subject of scientific research. Researchers focus on their foraging habits, breeding patterns, and population trends. By using satellite tags, scientists can monitor penguin movements, uncovering their feeding areas and migration paths. This information is crucial for understanding how climate change might affect penguin populations and their habitats. The island's invertebrate species are also a key focus, with new discoveries shedding light on evolutionary mechanisms in Heard Island and McDonald Islands, despite their forbidding remoteness, have a history rich with tales of human exploration and endeavor. Their discovery was a testament to the adventurous spirit of sailors who navigated the perilous waters of the Southern Ocean in the 19th century. These were not journeys for the faint-hearted. The seas around the islands are notoriously turbulent, whipped by fierce winds and often cloaked in fog. It was amidst this maritime fury that Captain John Heard, an American sealer, first sighted Heard Island in November 1853. Sailing from Boston aboard the ship, Heard was en route to the newly established whaling grounds in the Indian Ocean. His discovery, initially marked by little fanfare, would etch his name on the map and pave the way for further exploration of this remote corner of the world. Just a few weeks later, in January 1854, Captain William MacDonald, also an American sealer, stumbled upon the islands that would bear his name. Sailing aboard the MacDonald's Discovery added another chapter to the story of this isolated archipelago. These early sightings, driven by the pursuit of marine wealth, marked the beginning of human interaction with Heard and MacDonald Islands. After their discovery, Heard and McDonald Islands briefly became a hotspot for the sealing industry. Attracted by the lucrative fur seals, sealers set up temporary camps, enduring the severe weather to hunt these marine mammals. Life on the islands was harsh. Sealers faced relentless storms, scarce supplies, and the constant threat of shipwrecks. The sealing era, while initially profitable, severely impacted the island's seal populations. By the late 1800s, overhunting had drastically reduced the once abundant seal colonies. With their primary resource depleted, the islands were mostly abandoned, left to the elements and the few seals that survived the hunter's onslaught. 
In the early 1900s, human interest in the islands shifted. Scientific expeditions, keen to explore the unique flora, fauna, and geology of this remote archipelago, began to arrive. Despite the logistical challenges of reaching and working on the Heard and McDonald Islands stand as one of the last truly pristine wilderness areas on Earth. Their isolation, severe weather, and absence of permanent human presence have shielded them from the development and exploitation seen elsewhere. In 1997, their outstanding natural value was acknowledged with their inscription on the UNESCO World Heritage List. This recognition emphasizes the island's global importance and the necessity of their continued protection. As a World Heritage Site, the islands are governed by stringent conservation protocols. Entry to the islands is highly regulated, requiring permits for any landings or research endeavours. Australia, tasked with the island's stewardship, is pivotal in their preservation and management. The Australian Antarctic Division undertakes regular research missions, monitoring ecosystems, studying unique species, and collecting critical data on climate change and environmental threat. Heard and McDonald Islands are a testament to nature's enduring power. Their isolation offers a rare glimpse into a world free from human interference. These volcanic islands, shaped by ice and wind, serve as a living laboratory where life thrives in extreme conditions. They provide sanctuary for penguins, seals, and a surprising variety of plant life, all surviving in this harsh environment. Beyond their raw beauty, these islands are invaluable for scientific research. They hold Earth's history within layers of volcanic rock and ancient ice. As sentinels of climate change, their shrinking glaciers and shifting ecosystems warn us of global challenges. Isolation has driven evolution here, resulting in unique species found nowhere else. These islands remind us of the importance of preserving Earth's wild places. They call us to protect these fragile ecosystems for their intrinsic value and the lessons they offer. In their isolation, these islands symbolize hope and resilience in a changing world. May their wild beauty inspire us to be better stewards of our planet, ensuring these islands remain sanctuaries for future generations.